Hey everybody, welcome back to Doodly D's Farm. Before we get started, I wanted to remind everybody that our free tour is coming up on April the 9th. That's 2016, April the 9th at 10 o'clock. Be sure to come out. Uh, the crowds have been great before with a lot of great uh, question and answer periods. We sure do uh, would like to have you out and would like to see you. Uh, this is our new greenhouse. We have two other ones, uh, or these two that are identical, and then one other one that's larger. Uh, this video is going to be a little bit more technical, so some of you viewers that uh, are not technically into aquaponics, you might not want to watch the remaining video. The ones that are, you'll probably be very excited, like we are. Uh, what we have done here is created a 102-foot troughs, four of them. There are 7,500 plants in each trough. They're six feet wide. We have two oxygen hoses running on both sides of the uh, troughs. We have invented what we are going to start installing in a couple of days, a system that alleviates us having a seedling room, which allows us to seed, push it down, lift the whole thing up, and then dip them down back in water, uh, and then lift it up as needed. So we don't have to individually or hose off uh, for our watering needs. It should save us about a full day in man hours whenever we get it finished. We'll show you that in a later video. But we thought it was appropriate to have as much oxygen as possible so we put two oxygen hoses in. This thing, uh, unlike our other greenhouses that we have, the greenhouse itself is 135 feet long and We've had too many pumps in our other greenhouses. This greenhouse we designed with only one pump. So we're pumping a significant amount of water, about 20,000 gallons, with one 6,000 gallon per hour pump. And how it works is the water flows through each one of these troughs equally. It goes to the end of each trough with three three inch outlets. And they flow by gravity underneath the ground where they're laying the new weed mat or not weed it's similar to weed mat but it's the uh, greenhouse black cover the pipe flows gravity feeds and runs in between these other two greenhouses straight down to the pump it lifts it up into the fish tank which is behind the greenhouse and then gravity feeds from there on the other end so it really is efficient and it's worked out really well. We just finished, the t uh, these are the tomato troughs on this wall. We made it about two and a half times deeper than our original one in our, and what I refer to as our show greenhouse because the root balls get so large with tomatoes. We wanted them to have plenty of room to grow and a massive amount of oxygen which you can see the oxygen hose and PVC pipes running into them now. We just started our to cycle this system. We just planted uh, a small amount of plants here and we're getting ready to fill all of these up. So all of the troughs and tomatoes combined will be uh, about 32,000 plants in this one greenhouse. That'll be the same for the next greenhouse. And the two greenhouses on the other side are about uh, 20 feet larger or longer. So we'll be able to have significantly more in there. Another innovation that we have done is on this section behind me, I might just walk right here past my sister who's filming me, excuse me. And we can, you can see right here, there's about a 25 foot section where the troughs start, stop and end at the wall that we're gonna have what's gonna appear to be bunk beds that will, uh, we're gonna grow microgreens. And currently we use all these beds now inside that have um, as our seedling beds. And now we're no longer gonna to have to do those because the plants inside of these troughs are gonna lift up so they don't get soaked during the seedling process. And some of you may ask that are technical in this matter, well, how are you gonna uh, keep the seeds in the dark you know, as they're germinating for the first three days, which a lot of uh, plants require, uh, we're going to have a roll at the end of 90% shade cloth that we roll all the way down on a little uh, rail and cover it up for three days and then just roll it right back up. 
So it's going to be, we're really excited about that and the efficiency and labor man hours in watering. Uh, there are a lot of other uh, efficiencies that we've added to the greenhouse of you, you people that have uh, gardening aspirations or you are currently gardeners or you really are fascinated by aquaponics like many of you are. Uh, please come out to our uh, free tours we offer once every quarter and again the next one is uh, April 9th. Again I'm Farmer Kevin with Doodly Deep Farms.